Hey everyone, Cosmic Lens here. I'm on my way to my Astro spot. It's Portland 4 scale and it's good enough, it's dark enough to have both Milky Way, both Milky Way and Deep Sky objects. Of course, lower Portland scales are better, cleaner images, but you have to drive a lot of hours far away from the city to reach Portland 3, 2 or 1. Tonight I will show you how to capture the Milky Way galaxy easy and fast with just one camera, DSLR and the tripod. The specific camera is the Canon 4000D. Right now it's the cheapest camera on the EU market and just the tripod. And as you can see it's still daytime but let's transfer to the dark. And we transferred to the dark, it's completely dark around, I can't see nothing and I use the red lights to keep my night vision and let's go to the captures. First of all, you have to see where the Milky Way is. You can open your Stellarium map in your mobile phone and see the correct way the Milky Way goes into the night sky. So first step, open the camera. Here, adjust the ISO at the highest point and the time also to the highest. The most of the cameras has 30 seconds. Open here the live view. Try to zoom and see the stars. Maybe now you can't see the, the point stars on the screen. But if you can't see nothing, you have to turn your camera to a bright star and zoom manually and focus correctly. So when you do this, you go to the settings again. Take the ISO back to 3200. Here we're gonna go to 13 seconds because we don't have a tracker, we have this tripod. And let's turn the camera here. We have both foreground and the Milky Way. So let's close the light and start. Okay, as you can see, down there is my light and here is the Milky Way. This little over there is the Lagoon Nebula. So now I will turn all the lights off and I'm gonna capture about 40 or 50 images like this. I adjust here the settings to have 10 captures by one click. And let's start. The most important thing in astrophotography, even it's a wide field, even it's deep sky, is the focusing. Take your time, do some test shots, see what works, what not, correct the focus, stop the session, correct again, and start again. This is the only way to have the experiment to manually focus, because it's not like the daytime photography, it's a little bit different. I just finished the captures of the Milky Way, and now I packed everything up, and I am ready to drive one hour from the mountain to the city to go back home to process this data. To show you what can you do with just a cheap DSLR camera and a plastic tripod. Don't forget to subscribe, to drop a like and let me know if you ever try to capture the Milky Way Galaxy into the comments. So now let's see the final image of what we did.